The following segment is sponsored by Eastern's Automotive Group. In this month's Road to a Better Community, we meet an eight-year-old boy from Gaithersburg who turned the darkest time of, in, of his life into a mission to spread kindness everywhere he goes. And I won't be surprised if that lady comes today. Eight-year-old Kavanaugh Bell is on the lookout in this Gaithersburg neighborhood. On the lookout for someone in need of help and kindness. It's the mission of spreading light that Kavanaugh and his mom Lacey set out on during a time of darkness. You see, I was being bullied and I didn't want kids to feel the same way I felt because I had a darkness inside of me and I didn't eat for 11 weeks. But especially I was being bullied for just being smart and not looking like other kids. But it was Kavanaugh's mom that reminded him he was perfect just the way he was. Inevitably, when you have your child like share a traumatic thing that they're going through, there's a sense of kind of failure, like I didn't protect them. And so having been, you know, bullied growing up myself, it was important for me to try to empower him as much as possible so that he would feel like there was nothing wrong with him that he needed to change to be accepted. And in response, Kavanaugh and Lacey created the nonprofit Cool and Dope, a tribe of positivity creators. Our goal to create, you know, kid led campaigns like the mobile pantries or, you know, prior to this, Kavanaugh will go speak with lawmakers about bullying. It's really important for us to create opportunities for our kids to be leaders. So that way they feel empowered within themselves to speak up and speak out. We got the name off of what we usually say all the time, like all the time. I, I say cool, she says dope. Cool and dope also stands for considering others obstacles in life. Dish out positive energy. It's very, very cool. My mom obviously came up with it. <laughs> And, and then, what does that mean? and it means you don't know what's going on in other people's lives, so stay positive and be positive. What started as an anti-bullying campaign pivoted during the pandemic. Kavanaugh created a food pantry, which evolved into emergency care packages for COVID-19 positive families. And now mobile pantries like this one in Gaithersburg, filled with necessities free of charge for the public. It's a lot of work between the two of us. Every week we drive around and fill these mobile pantries to make sure they're st fully stocked. Our goal is to have 10 of these throughout Montgomery County and keep them maintained through the summer. Well, this journey has been pretty fun because I'm, I'm, obviously I'm able to help my community, but I'm also happy that me and my mom are a team and it's just, it's just been really fun. Kavanaugh has inspired so many people to spread kindness in their community, including our friends at Eastern's Automotive Group. And on behalf of Eastern's Automotive, they want to donate $1,500 to Cool and Dope. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> He's speechless, Mom. Yeah, he is, he is. No, that's going to really help us help so many more people. The donation from Eastern's Automotive will allow Kavanaugh and Lacey to create three more mobile pantries. That would mean we have 11 pantries. Yeah. 11. And what's the goal? 10. 10. There you go. So that helps you surpass your goal right there. Because of the kindness shown by this community, Kavanaugh's light is shining brighter than ever. I feel beautiful inside and now I just want to spread all the positivity that I can spread in the world. Isn't he just amazing? Kavanaugh and Lacey, truly amazing people. For more information on how Eastern's Automotive Group helps organizations on a road to a better community, head to WUSA9.com slash better community.